what is up Kilo crew and welcome to today's video. Today Randy and I are on our way to Clinton, Iowa to a place called Backshot Pizza where we're going to be doing, finally it's been a long time, a cutesy little team pizza challenge. It should be, be precious. It should be so precious. And this one coincidentally is called the Dump Truck Pizza Challenge which is kind of similar to the pizza challenge we met at which was a garbage can pizza. So, 22 months ago. Oh isn't that just totes adorbs. But anywho we're really excited to take this on. This is kicking off a very long road trip series for us before we head to Ireland for like an indefinite amount of fun and travel coming up later in June. So anyway, super excited for this. We will of course catch you guys inside Backshot Pizza when the giant dump truck pizza challenge arrives. up kilo crew and welcome to this fun and very delicious first team pizza challenge back in quite some time that is amazing seriously look at the fold on this thing that's got to be kind of hard to do on a pizza that size <laughs> <laughs> yeah i actually said that because this wasn't just mozzarella on the pizza it was a four cheese blend and that was amazing it was a super double c thick layer of cheese the crust has a really nice chew to it. I can see why it's taking the teams a long time. It is a pretty chewy crust, but it's like a really good whole zone kind of crust too. It doesn't get soft. Yeah, so we had an hour to eat this pizza and there had been three winning teams in the past before us and it took them around 53 minutes to finish this thing. And I can definitely see why there was a good chew to that crust. If we would have started when Katina wanted to, this pizza would be way too hot, but it's no. perfect temperature now. <laughs> No. Yeah, in typical Randy fashion, it took about 20, almost 30 minutes of setup time before we got to dig into this thing, so it was a bit on the cold side, but that kind of tells you how good the pizza was, it was still really enjoyable that much later after it had been sitting out. That was me admitting that the, uh, the crust was starting to give me a little bit of lockjaw there, so he came to my rescue. You guys feel like a very hair sauce? Yeah. Would I be able to get like a small bowl? Or else French red hot sauce. Okay. Please. <laughs> yeah, who uh who puts Frank's red hot sauce on their pizza? That's strange to me. I can wrap myself in this like a blanket. <laughs> This was definitely no small pizza. 30 inches, roughly 10 and a half, 11 pounds, crazy big. I hired her to be here. I love you guys. I love you guys so much. <laughs> yeah, she was so sweet. But anyways, more details on this challenge. We had one hour to finish this 30-inch pizza. If we were successful, we did get the $60 pizza for free, $60 in gift cards to use later, groovy t-shirts, and of course, spots up on their wall of fame. So we were definitely jazzed to get up there. You can do it. <laughs> I would love to actually get Rob Schneider at For real though, if I had a dollar for every time someone screamed, you can do it during a challenge, I'd be pretty darn wealthy. But yeah, you only really had to get one topping on this pizza and Randy and I ended up going with chicken, green peppers, and red peppers. So this thing looked like Christmas. Last one. You got it. Yeah, so it does look like I'm super far ahead of Randy here because I'm about to slice ahead, but remember, he did eat all of the crust for me since I was getting so tired. For sure, feeding my ego feeds my hunger. Oh. <laughs> he did the same thing. I ate like two thirds of a tin cheesecake once. <laughs> oh. That's 
I will never let him live that down. But yeah, that was just some friendly banter there. I was super thankful. I definitely would have lost this thing if it weren't for Randy chewing through all of that crust. So he was a real trooper. This is love. He eats the crust and leaves me the cheesy bits. It definitely is love because this pizza, like I said, was super tasty. The combo of the chicken, the green and red peppers, and of course the four cheeses was a delightful, delightful surprise. Kind of unique. So I'm happy that we were kind of cocky as a team and did more than one topping. <laughs> and on that adorable TMI note, I'm going to leave you guys to enjoy the rest of the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will, of course, catch you guys in the next one. Catch you guys in the next one. Okay, peace out. Bye. Bye. Bye.